Children are said to be a blessing to every parent, watching them grow a veritable source of joy. But their growth and future have been threatened globally by poverty, hunger, diseases and death. To address these issues, world leaders agreed to work at the beginning of the millennium towards reducing child mortality by two-thirds by the year 2015. What we should be looking at is what are the interventions that are put in on the daily basis okay, in the country to see that childhood mortality is reducing. Reducing child mortality was one of the Millennium Development Goals. It has been largely successful in the world, except in Nigeria and a few countries in Sub-Saharan Africa. Rather than child mortality rate going down in Nigeria, the multiple indicator cluster survey shows it actually increased from 158 per 1,000 live births in 2007 to 158 per 1,000 live births in 2011. Nigeria loses about 2,300 under five year olds every day, making the country the second largest contributor to child mortality worldwide. We are trying to address how to get better uh, baseline uh, population data so that we can uh, uh, accurately assess the true uh, uh, indices, uh, health indices we have in Nigeria. They say preventable diseases account for about 70% of the death rate. Looking at this beautiful and cute faces, all of which reflect promises of a better tomorrow, it is sad to know that somewhere in Nigeria, each year, charming wounds like this will die of malaria, pneumonia, measles, malnutrition, all of them preventable causes. Problems like lack of proximity of healthcare posts to target people at the grassroots, non-functional health centers and unqualified healthcare personnel have also been blamed for these grim statistics. We need resources, both human and material resources. There are some government hospitals that do not have incubators. Children that need incubators will then not be cared, cared for. They will easily die. So it's a matter of ingesting resources into maternal and child care. Statistics has it the seven high mortality countries, Bangladesh, Ethiopia, Liberia, Malawi, Nepal, Timor-Leste and Tanzania have reduced the around the five mortality rates by two-thirds since 1990. Six of these countries are not rich, which is proof the national income is not a barrier to making good progress. Nigeria, it seems, is still working out modalities to reduce its child mortality rate. The Nigerian Minister of Health has identified that yes, we are still not there, but uh, we are planning in, in our next year, uh, uh, this year budget and next five year plan to squarely address, you know, with the SHOPI, with the uh, MDGs and the budget of the Federal Minister of Health, but particularly now with the participation of the private sector and the NGOs, it will be a great uh, uh, difference. Uh, we are now on track in transforming the Nigerian public health. If we had much action, then the future of many Nigerian children would have been saved. Wendy Abu, TVC News, Lagos.